Well, so we are at this uh, cafe restaurant in Bowling Springs. I got the uh, flautas and he got the... Oh, oh sorry. Oh, you're good. <laughs> so, all right, dig in. All right, I am just outside of our campground. Literally camped at the edge of a cornfield. An actual campsite here is beautiful. You see the mountains over there in the distance and all cornfields. And I just spread manure recently, so it smells like manure, but... I kind of feel like I'm in the movie uh, Children of the Corn, if you've ever seen that back in the 80s. So, walk back here and show you the campsite we're at. I'm at 1,124.3. That's where I'm out of the map. We only did, like I said, seven point some miles, almost eight today, I think it was, to get here. It's a nice little campsite, though. Beside the smell, I have a porta potty right here. We're going to the bathroom in. Nice big grassy area. One tent right here. It's not ours. Someone else is here. Look area here, and I'm over here, straight ahead behind the picnic table. And Birdie's right back over here behind this tree. And so nothing going on. So this is the most uneventful Fourth of July I've ever had. So I'm just going to lay in my tent and watch some movies while I can. And tomorrow I'll just recharge my phone before we leave town. Y'all have a great night, and we'll see you tomorrow. All right, good morning. Morning of day number 96. Uh, camped out outside the cornfield back here. It's up really good. Played on my phone, listened to fireworks go off. It's kind of boring, but it uh, been better to have somebody to share it with. And I hang out with some people and grill and cook some hot dogs and stuff, but... Other than that, it was still good. So now I'm heading back into town. I'm gonna charge my phone for a little bit and hit the trail. And I've got a big, long flat section to do today. After this flat section, I won't climb, and that's it. So, 14 something miles to go, and we'll be there. So, you guys have a good day. I was leaving town today. This is what the trail looks like. So. So far, I'm walking kind of like a little shaded area on the outskirts of these fields, and I hope it stays this way. Uh, so I'm guessing this is wheat or a barley. I'm not sure. If anybody knows, let me know. It goes really tall. This is some shorter stuff. But, beautiful day out. It's supposed to rain this afternoon. We'll, we'll see. So, here we go, walking along, heading to our destination. And we're going to see what happens today and how it goes. And just enjoy the ride. Or walk, I should say. This looks like I'm out Midwest somewhere. That's what it reminds me of. Pennsylvania is a pretty place, I must say. So all these states I'm coming up to that I've never been before, so it's all going to be a new experience for me. Never been to New Jersey. Uh, well, I went to a gas station. I don't really count, though. But uh, Been to New York before. I'm excited to go there again. But um, Vermont. Never been to Vermont. Never been to Massachusetts. Never been to Connecticut. Never been to Maine. So all these places I'm going to be coming up to are going to be just an awesome experience. I can't wait to hike through them. There's my blaze. Still on the trail. Hiking along. Okay, I'm out in this field. And this is the plant. Is it barley? Or is this wheat? Anybody know? I have no clue. Well, I found this uh, little old cemetery, a little small thing, but all the graves near are 1800s. 1824, 1809, 1806. This is pretty awesome. Wow. Got a deer out here in this field.
see if it runs away when I get up here. Yep, there she goes. Okay, the trail comes right beside this Amish farm and they have this little roadside stuff. They sell all their uh, fresh stuff. They have corn and broccoli, cauliflower, pints of fresh blueberries, uh, some cold drinks even. But the best thing I like, they have this homemade chocolate milk. I wanted to try it, but I didn't have enough cash on me to get some of that. So, oh, I'm going to sit here and take a break. Enjoy my Gatorade and lunch. So while I'm at this uh, little roadside stand, I'm having this uh, tomato basil, basil tuna. This is really good. And some Ritz crackers and some uh, fruit snacks. And do my Gatorade and relax for a bit. This section of the show is pretty cool. It's a big long boardwalk you to walk on. Because there's water right there. So I guess certain times of year this is probably impassable without it. But it's easy walking. And that's what I like. Today's been great. Only climb I've got is like the last mile or two, and that's it. Everything else has been like this all day. So this has been the best hiking day on trail I've had so far in Pennsylvania. Beautiful countryside and fields and farms and flat areas. Did I mention it's flat? I love it. I'm almost to the shelter, and there's a uh, old race car up here. What's well, left one, I should say. Remains. So, pretty cool. Alright, just made it to the shelter. It was raining, so... The last mile up started to rain, but I had my rain gear on. But, uh... Got a little bit wet, but not too bad. Did, uh, 14.3 miles. I'm at 1138.6. 1138.6 is my total miles where I'm at on the trail. So I'm sitting in the shelter, as soon as it stops raining, let me turn the camera around. I'm going to go set my tent up somewhere, I don't know where yet, but could sleep in here because there's these bunks and stuff in here. But I don't know if I want to sleep in here with a bunch of other people. I can't have my privacy in my tent. But it is nice to stay dry at night too, and I have to have a wet tent. So let's see what the red huh. Huh. Let's see what the weather's gonna do. This weather does make me sleepy though. So have a good afternoon. Good morning, morning of day number 97. Leaving the shelter here. Gonna get back on trail. We're gonna go into town. We got a 15.4 mile hike to do today total. So there's a town here. We're gonna stop in there, get a couple little things and a little restaurant, and stop at and head back on trail so that's the usual plan and we're just hiking along we got uh, probably another month and uh let's see hold on I'm gonna finish out this month there's about 20 something days left this month 20 days or so and then uh I got the whole next month and then september maybe only two or three weeks of that and i'll be finished so just gotta hang in there and get it done See how it goes. Going across this road crossing, beautiful view. All right, as I'm coming off this mountain, I got this beautiful view up here. And out of this rock, I looked over there and it's straight down. You can see the river down there to give you a little perspective. Big lake over there. I think that's where we're going. I think that's the town of Duncannon. Pretty sure. Or maybe it's over here. I'm not sure. So we got to go down this mountain and then walk a little bit and I'll be in town. So this is the town of Duncannon. I'm actually walking down to this Lutheran church. They have a free spaghetti dinner for hikers so but most of the hikers that are at the uh, hostel back there are gonna go get pizza so I don't know 
I'm just gonna show up, but I'm heading there. I like free. So anyway.